ladies and gentlemen, welcome to day two. Oh, I didn't mean to rhyme, but hey, it's, you know, it's whatever. Welcome to day two of Community Day 2020. This is the last Community Day of this year. And we're gonna start it off with some two kilometer egg hatches. I think I have eight of these. I have eight eggs that I'm hatching right now. It's actually very important for me to be hatching these eggs because today, oh my God, look at all the Pokemon. Today, in addition to, of course, getting shinies, we are focusing on getting good IV Pokemon. That means I'm going to be doing a bunch of raids, a bunch of egg hatches, trying to get some good IV things, trying to get some shinies as well. You know, we hatched a shiny yesterday. If you guys haven't seen the last Community Day Adventure, go watch that. Oh my gosh. As you can see, the weather isn't too beautiful right now. It is raining, it is cold, it is windy. So we are going to be spending a little bit of Community Day in this little structure. Please, come on, come on, anything. I already have so many shinies from these Community Days that that's not really the priority today. I want a good IV thing to evolve, but I love hatching eggs because you get a bunch of candy and you get a bunch of XL candy, which people don't really realize is it's pretty hard to come by. I'll do a video on XL candies. I'm sure you guys might want to know more about them. Torchic, come on, don't do me wrong. Don't do me dirty, don't do me dirty. Hook me up with something fire. Mudkip. Well, those are the eggs. Unfortunately, a little bit underwhelming, but we got a bunch of spawns right here. Let's check them out, man. What are we gonna get today? What are we gonna get? Magikarp, Magmar, oh my gosh. Somebody here has gotta be shiny. We just pulled up to the cluster. Hours and hours of community day still left to go. I actually got to catch you guys up I got a couple of shinies since I ended the last video. So we got to talk about those as well Come on somebody in here has got to be good nothing on the Porygon either dude. What are we doing here? What are we doing? Yo, oh my gosh Let me know in the comments down below. How did your community day go man? I'm, I'm rapping and rhyming all, all a bunch today. Let me know in the comments down below how you guys community day went I had such a great time this weekend. Well, anyways, let's go ahead and take a look at the shinies we got, or the shinies I didn't show you. I think the last thing I showed you was that last Abra. So, last night, I ended up getting a Ghastly, Shiny Ghastly, not bad, not bad. A Shiny Magmar, 15, 15, 5. And then, of course, a Shiny Porygon, beautiful. And as soon as I put the camera down, my first check is the Shiny Charmander. That's a beautiful way to start off the day, dude. So, yesterday, we got 20 shinies. Trust me, we could have got a lot more. I got 15 in the first hour, and then I was like, eh, let's just chill. So we got 20 shinies. I guess that's what we're trying to beat today. Starting it off with a shiny Charmander right there. 244 IVs. Not too bad, not too bad. Let's go ahead and keep catching. This cluster is pretty big. Going to get a lot of spawns, a lot of research, a lot of raids, a lot of eggs, a lot of hatches, a lot of shinies. Let's go. Okay, I just took down a Regirock. I've done probably close to 30 or 40 of these within the last day or so, and I can't get the shiny. It's one of the only legendary shinies I don't have to this day. Please don't suck, bro. What is going on? I've literally done so many, too many actually, too many Regirock. I also need Reggie Ice when that comes out later this month, but again, Regirock is, is letting me down. And down it goes right there, bada bing, bada boom. I'm not gonna check IVs because I know it ain't good. What's on my nearby? What do I got? Uh, a Kurum. I'll do a Kurum, sure. A little shout out to Ninja for the for the raid invite. I appreciate you. Wait, hold on, let me hop in. Blech. Oh my gosh, finally, dude, finally. I've been talking all weekend about getting a hundo. And guess what hundo we get? Hundo Charmander spawn. And honestly, man, this is my fifth, my fifth hundo Charmander. Yes, that's pretty incredible to believe, but I have five of these guys and I'm gonna evolve this one all the way through. Why not, why not? I don't have any legacy moves on my hundos. Oh, at least not this one, so. We're gonna evolve this bad boy all the way through. But how awesome, how awesome is that, man? The only hundo we have so far <laughs> from Community Day is a Charmander spawn. I love it. Imagine if it was a Shundo, though. Oh my gosh. I don't even know when I caught this thing either. Down goes the Charizard 1321 CP hundo. Yes, sir. Let's go, man. That's a beautiful one with the legacy move on it, of course. Also, I have got some shinies. Last thing you guys saw was this Charmander right here, and then we ended up getting ourselves this Magmar, so that's another shiny on the day. We got this Magikarp, and then of course another Magmar that was almost a Shiro, almost a shiny 0% IV, and then another Magmar after that. So we're doing pretty gosh darn well. Today, today only, we're at five. We got three during non-community day hours, and then five today, so you know, whatever you want to call it, but we're doing pretty gosh darn good. We've only been doing community day for about an hour or so, and I'm having a great time. A little shiny check action. I've been doing a bunch of raids too, a bunch of raids. I've done so many Regirock raids, so many. 
like off camera today and I just I can't get the shiny man I don't know what it is I don't know if the rates were high it was a raid day weekend but I've done 40 raids and just not much going on okay and we actually got ourselves a shiny electabuzz off the go plus which is very very nice 222 CP right there that's given us what six shinies on the day and if you want to count this adventure, I guess you can call it nine. So we're doing pretty great in that department, but we also gotta move on with the special research. I actually finished this, wait, what? Oh God, okay. We gotta finish our, or claim our research break to 3,000 dust, 20 Pokeballs. I actually need those Pokeballs right now. I'm down. We got a Lapras spawn. Oh, we were either gonna get Lapras or Darumaka. My guess was Lapras, I was right, but unfortunately not a shiny one. I don't think it's good IVs either. It just, I don't know. It doesn't like, it doesn't like look slash sound good. Also, how far is he, bro? I just threw like 15 balls at the ground, but down goes Lapras right there. Bada bing, bada boom. Still a very rainy and cold day. It is showering, sprinkling. 11.05, Lapras, don't suck. You suck. Anyways, let's go ahead and claim all of these rewards right here. And then, of course, move on with our special research. I'm curious, is that, a, is that an Elite Fast or an Elite Charged? Let's see. It's an Elite Fast. Wow, they really gave us an Elite TM. That's pretty, uh, that's pretty dope, man. I'll take that Rocket Radar Dust. And the last stage is to catch 15 Electabuzz, Magmar Pokemon, and another Elite Charged. Oh my god. Alright, and we are doing some evolutions. Right now I'm going to be evolving this pretty good Ultra League Empoleon. Uh, I mean, I don't know how useful he is in the Ultra League, but these are pretty good PvP IVs. So for whenever this is going to be useful, let's do it. Okay, there we go. Is There's the Empoleon. I'm um, looking around for more things to do. There's a little Torterra evolution for the one time. Absolutely love this guy. Wish I had a good IV version of him, but... Frankly, I don't. That's going to be a really solid one in the Great League. I'm going to do a bunch of evolutions off camera. If anything is really, really good, I'll definitely make sure to turn it back on. But these are mainly going to be like PvP's 98. So we're going to go ahead and move through this quickly. And actually, you know what? Before we... Uh, let me do this last shift trade and then I want to show you guys something. We got another shiny. We got a shiny Magikarp. Oh, wow. 64 CP. Almost a really, really good IV one. I will take that, dude. Yes, sir. Just today, like just today, I've done over 20 Regirock. I don't know what it is, man. That shiny is going to be tough. And if I don't get it today, I don't know when the next opportunity I'm going to have is. So this is going to this is going to be a grind for sure. I'm, I'm kind of kind of nervous. And look who's joining us. Shiny Charmander, 158 CP. What shiny is this? How many how many do we have today? I don't know, but we're over 10. So we're doing pretty gosh darn well. Like I said, man, the weather kind of ruined the whole... Not, it didn't ruin, but I would have liked to have been outside walking around and about and getting eggs off and all that good stuff. And maybe it'll clear up and, and, and I'm down to go... Wait, what? You really jumped out? Down to go out if it clears up. But uh, yeah, man, I'm definitely having a pretty good community day. I've been doing a bunch of evolutions. I've been clearing up a bunch of candy searching for some good IV things. I've been doing every single gosh darn raid near me. 158 shiny CP, wait what, shiny Charmander uh, CP low, IVs low. Can we go back to back, please? No. And just a couple seconds later, we got ourselves another shiny Electabuzz, 1562 CP. I actually want to check my Electabuzzes out because I want to know if I got any good Electivire for the Ultra League. I know uh, his moveset's pretty good, so let me see if I can get something going with that. I've done a bunch of other evolutions, though. Hey. I'm telling you, when 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 I feel like changing it up, changing up the squad for PvP, I got a lot of options now. And really quick, I'm gonna get a quick special trade done with my buddy Steven. Uh, he needs a he needs more regional Pokemon, and I had an extra Pachirisu from GoFest, so I'm gonna send that over to him, and he's gonna give me a Lugia. Hey, you never know; these community days bring in in general luck. So maybe, just maybe, we can get something good. 1963. One of the worst Lugias I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Alright, well hey, it was worth it. We got him a got him a little regional and we got a little special trade in, but still grinding. We got three hours left. So we're halfway in in the community day hours. Community day window. And still getting some shinies. And look who decided to show up. The sun. It is clearer skies. And we are at Niles. We are at Niles. Now we can start hatching some eggs. Now we can start raiding, getting new Pokemon, new spawns. And we're finally just out and about because sitting in that sitting in that garage was not the most exciting thing, I know. But we're here and I go plus some shinies on the way here. We got this shiny Charmander, not that good. Uh, shiny Electabuzz, not that great. Another shiny Electabuzz, another Charmander, another Electabuzz, and another Magikarp. 
we have a lot of shinies today. And unfortunately, not a lot of them have been on camera. I keep go plusing them, which I feel bad about, but at least we're increasing our shiny number. That's definitely one thing when we claim all that good stuff right there. We do have some new raids on our nearby as well, uh, which I'm actually definitely gonna do. We have a Regirock coming up soon. Dude, Regirock leaves today at the end of the day, and I don't have the shiny yet. I don't know what else I need to do, but I guess we gotta do more of them. Anyways, I'm gonna get to walking because I wanna get at least a batch or two of eggs off today. Let's keep on going. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are hatching some eggs. I said I was here to hatch eggs, and eggs are going to be hatched. Waltz. Egg number two, Mr. Totodile. How you doing, buddy? Please don't suck. Oh. Egg number three, Turwig. Hey, I need me a good Turwig. What are we doing here? 658, how you looking? How you looking? I won't stop until I get something good. Got a bag on. Another one, Swinub. Please don't disappoint swine up please don't suck Ugh. dude we hatched a shiny in our first batch of eggs yesterday and i was like oh this is going to be great this is going to be absolutely great and i'm going to be honest we haven't got anything since then not even like a good iv hatch really well i got that total right there but nothing much nothing much but it's not going to stop me i'm going to continue to get them going another dude another bag on oh my gosh 641 this one's a little higher and not high enough okay the eggs were not that great but we're gonna get some more going and ladies and gentlemen shiny charmander far 52 cp right there just adding to our shiny count on the day dude we've been doing really well we've been doing really well i've been doing a lot of raids a lot of hashing a lot of catching our stardust's flying our xp's flying our candies are flying it's been a good overall time. Even if we don't get many shinies, I'm not tripping. And we are getting a lot of shinies. So it's just been great overall. I'm walking to a torchic raid. I'm doing another raid on the way there. This is good. This is good. Let me know in the comments down below. How many shinies did you get on day one, on day two, and overall? Right now, it's looking like we're going to get close to probably close to like 40, maybe even 50 if I, if I try pretty hard. Still got exactly an hour left in community day. We'll see what happens. Speaking of hatching eggs, we got some 12 kilometer eggs hatching right now. I haven't hatched one of these. Trubbish. 12 kilometers. And we hatched trash. Literally. Do I have any more? Was that it? Oh, that was it. I just have two more in the back. Okay. Well, listen, the eggs are going. I'm going. And I will never hatch 12 kilometer egg again. And just a couple of seconds later, shiny Porygon 22 CP. Gotta love that. We got that pink sweater on. He's got that pink pants on, I guess. Dude, come on. Jesus, all right. Shiny Porygon right there. We're doing pretty good, man. Pretty gosh darn good. I'm having a great time today. Down goes Shiny Porygon. 22 CP, a level one shiny. I like that. I'm gonna keep that. I'm gonna keep that for sure. Anything else? Back to back on the Porygons. New. No. All right, here come the two kilometer eggs. I think I only have six or seven of them. Let's see if we get anything good. Actually, I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna interrupt it. I'm gonna interrupt it. I cheated. I went, and go, I went ahead and looked at my recents. Let's just see if we got anything good from these egg hatches. And nothing. All right. Then I guess I'm getting some more. Dude, literally every time I end the recording on my camera, something else happens. Shiny Charmander, again, I just recorded that last clip like a step that way. I like it. I'm not mad. I'm having a good time. About an hour left in community day. It's bittersweet. Bittersweet. This was, this was a good time. You know, looking back at it, I wish with every Pokemon that I caught, we kind of had a, a talk about, you know, what we did for that community day. To be honest... I don't remember many of these community days, so that's not gonna really go over too well. But I know they were memorable. Like for example, the Rhyhorn, we were in Tahoe. That was a great time. Uh, I know we spent a couple of these community days at home, like Abra, Gengar, Porygon, Magikarp. We spent those at home. I don't even remember Electabuzz community day. I'm gonna be honest. I don't even remember that was even a thing. Oh, we spent that in uh, in the parking garage as well. Yeah, oh no, Charmander was in the garage. Okay, so, you know, good community days throughout the year. Not so memorable, but definitely a good time. And here we go, another shiny Magmar. Dude, we are, we are, we are flying right now. The momentum is, is at an all-time high. I've lost track of how many shinies we're at right now. Probably around 15 to 20, which is where we were at yesterday. But at the end of the day, I want to be 20, because that's technically what we got. So let's go ahead and make that number bigger. What do we got? Magmar, not great, not great, not great. I have turned off the Go Plus. I am literally just going around, catching it manually, playing this like a real true community day and i'm having a great time of course of course we got another shiny shiny electabuzz 1625 cp dude we have not taken a break today it has been go 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 i mean i've go plus a bunch of shinies sure but i've also caught a lot on my own and i am not mad about it we are just increasing our shiny number unfortunately none of them have really been good in terms of ivs which kind of sucks but i guess 
I'll have shinies for anybody who ever, ever meets me. Like literally, if you're watching this video, I will save a shiny for you because that's how many shinies we got at this point. You guys, another shiny Electabuzz 1345 CP. Bro, I checked my shiny count during this weekend. It's nothing crazy. It could be a lot better, but for me playing pretty casually, I would say I've let my Go Plus do a lot of the work. This has been a this has been a gosh darn good weekend. We'll talk more about that in a little bit, but let's go ahead and take down that Electabuzz IVs. Come on, nothing, 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 nothing. 30 minutes left. 30 minutes left. Can we make something out of it? Can we clutch up some more shinies? I think we can. And here come the eggs. Just to put the camera down. I'm uh, uh I'm gonna cheat this one too. I'm gonna cheat this one. Let's just see what we got. Let's just see what we got. Nothing. Nothing at all, but maybe IVs. Torchic bad, torchic bad, mucky bad, mucky bad. We're also okay. Uh, bag on, not that great. Trappage bad. Never mind. I did want to do one last thing. I want to finish off the last page of the research where we're going to be getting an elite charge TM, dude. I got so many of these. I don't know what to do with them. I really don't know what to do with them. Oh, okay. That's going to be it for the community day special research. I still got to do this level 43 thing. Not in a rush to do that, but that is that's it for today. That's it for today. Uh, I'm not gonna do the Curum. I don't think so. And what do you know? Shiny Charmander again, 578 CP. Let me take a squat, man. I feel like I've been walking forever. 578 Shiny Charmander. Listen, if I'm gonna stack up on Shinies, I am not upset if they're gonna be Shiny Charmanders. I am trying to get myself another Hundo though. That I don't know how that Hundo Charmander snuck in, but that was really, really cool. And then we got this Shiny 578. Not too great, not too great. Another one, back to back, something. Give me, send me. Uh, let's go Porygon, please. No. Well, I just had to run in the car because it is absolutely pouring right now. I had to run to the car because as soon as we got that Charmander, it just started <laughs> like the rain just started going and going and going. Oh, we just go plus to Shiny Electabuzz, like literally within the last five seconds. Nice, okay. We have a lot of shinies today. I mean, a lot. It is 4.45, we still have time in community day, but uh, it looks like we are being pushed out by mother nature, which is okay. We've done pretty insane up until this point, and to be frank, I'm, I'm wet, and and uh, I, think it's, I think it's time for us to go. Now I got 15 minutes left in community day. One last time before the window closes, I'm gonna go see if there's anything I need to evolve, and then uh, we'll figure it out from there, but we're gonna play this out, and then at the end of today, I'm gonna do a little wrap up, a recap on the insane day, because trust me, our shiny count today and yesterday, combined and separate, both pretty incredible. Just know that we beat yesterday's uh, shiny count. All right, you guys, that's gonna do it for December Community Day 2020. Honestly, I had a pretty good time, all things considered. We did pretty gosh darn well. Let's do a little recap. In two days of Community Day, and granted, I didn't go super hard. I feel like if I really wanted to, I easily could have got like over 100 shinies this weekend because I only played a few amount of hours and I pretty much just took it pretty chill, used the, used the Go Plus and all that good stuff, but we had a pretty good weekend. On the first day, you guys saw that we got 20 shinies, which is pretty cool. And on the second day, we got 25 shinies, bringing our total to a total of 45 shinies during the weekend. Listen, we could have done better, but that's pretty gosh darn good. I did get this Magikarp. I didn't show you guys this yet. We got this Magikarp off the Go Plus as well. But let's take a look. Let's do a recap on the entire Community Day weekend because we went kind of crazy, all things considered. Six shiny Charmander. Love that wanted more two weedle five abra two ghastly four rhyhorn what is that eight seven electabuzz five magmar four magikarp two porygon a torchic hatch two c dot and five piplup honestly man i am down for this that's a lot of shiny pokemon in just two days unfortunately none of them had any good ivs we also got the 100 iv charizard which we uh, evolved into today's adventure which was awesome and we evolved a bunch of other stuff as well and got some good legacy moves and we got some good pokemon out of it ladies and gentlemen that is gonna do it for today's video if you guys enjoyed make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already let me know in the comments down below how did your community day weekend go how was day one how was day two how was it overall i'm gonna be honest i loved it i would have loved some more better iv spawns but it was raining and i really wasn't able to get many uh boosted spawns it was kind of tough but it is what it is i appreciate you guys watching me sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already if i didn't say that but thank you so much for watching have a great rest of your day and i'll see your faces later deuces